Alright guys, so here we are once again for another Forza Motorsport 6 video. Today, we're jumping in the V8 Supercars. It's a series that I'm very familiar with, being Australian and being a, a series that I grew up watching, I know quite a bit about this sport. Now, that doesn't of course excuse the driving that I have in this video, it's going to be pretty damn terrible. This first run that you're going to see is me on my very first run on the controller. The next run I do will be on the, on the wheel and it'll be a lot more polished in the way that I drive and the way that, you know, I just do overtakes and everything. So, just excuse my driving, I'm sorry about that, but either way, we're here in Bathurst. This is probably the, the racetrack that I've driven the most out of any circuit in the world. I've actually done like three or four full-length Bathurst races on the old Toka uh, race driver games, or V8 supercar games as um, we know them here in Australia from a couple years ago, made by Codemasters. But as you can see, going through the dipper here, I lost the back end there, and I tried to overcorrect, and you, there's this weird thing with the physics and the and the assist with the, the sim steering. When you try and uh, overcorrect, you just spin out so much, but we caused a massive pile up there, as you can see, just holding up about 12 or 15 cars there. That was absolutely ridiculous, but we, we used the rewind, we carried on, and now we're going up the inside of Fabian Kiltarb there into... The cutting section, almost making a Greg Murphy, uh, Marcus Ambrose recreation there of the, the massive crash I had back in 2005. But we got through there, we managed to pick up a, more, a few more positions, and now we're battling with this uh, GT car on the start finish straight, squeezing him out on the outside there. We move into P3 and now break him into turn one. I'm losing my voice, by the way. I just, I, I have no voice at the moment as it is, but um, yeah, I'm sorry about that. But Either way, we carried on. This is the final lap, and we made a crucial mistake after the chase. Just two more corners to go. We went into the tyre barrier. We couldn't rewind it there, so we had to carry on. We lost a bunch of positions uh, getting back in front of the 4 GT there, but into P5, very disappointing after being in third place, after starting way down the order. We then made another mistake, just a massive lockup into the final corner. And uh, that was our race. Coming across the line, doing a bit of weavage. It's P6 here in our very first race around Bathurst on Forza Motorsport 6. So that was the first run done. I wanted to do another one because I just wasn't happy with that one. I wanted to do it on the wheel and just get a proper feel for these V8 supercars on Forza around Bathurst. So I've got to say the track this year is a lot better and the handling seems to be a little bit better. Although it could be improved in some places. It's hard to find the grip or like the, the limit. Sometimes you think you're going too slow, but then you you sort of cruise into a corner a little bit harder, and then just there's just a massive wall of understeer as the tires screech, which is really annoying, just having to find where the limit is. But that's going to do this video for today. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. That would really help me out. If you're new to the channel and you haven't seen my videos before, then do subscribe. I'll be uploading a few more Forza videos and obviously many more F1 2015 videos in the not too distant future. I'll have a Forza F1 gameplay coming out either later today or tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. And until my next video, guys, I'll see you next time.